I think uh, I think the construction industry, um, while certainly you know a lot of companies use a lot of tech, a lot are are decently behind. Um, I don't know when there's going to be a huge AI influence in the industry. Um, I've used it for um, I have to like write a report or I guess like formulate like a a common. Um, plan like one I used recently, a stormwater prevention plan. Um, I asked ChatGPT to you know put it you know write one using these parameters just to kind of get me a good outline, and then I edited it myself. Um, but I don't think there's a ton of work that you know really could be done using AI um, right now. Um, I'm sure there's some but you know some cool AI tools that could be um released in the near future but I, I don't see it really affecting many jobs unless we're talking about you know like what what you see in a tesla factory of robots you know putting cars together or things like that but um i don't think it's going to have a huge influence at least relative to other industries that's really good news i think that's hopefully music to a lot of folks ears as they've heard you speak tonight about the opportunities in construction Cheryl. Love this question. You know what? In the 2000s, like right before Y2K, they were saying librarians are going to be obsolete because of the internet, right? And look, we're still around. We're still kicking. And by the way, when the economy goes down, library business skyrockets. Why? Because people come to us to get their free information, to get job help to get all the things, LinkedIn learning, Safari tech books, um, all of the things that people want but can't pay for, the library has that. So as we're approaching AI, um, you know, will AI make librarians obsolete? And I have to say, no, we're pe just like Rick, we're people oriented business. That's why people come to us. Look, you could Google something at your house. You don't need me to answer it, but you still come to me because you want the human interaction. You want the tan, the the interacting with people. And so I think the key is, is that you have to use and leverage AI to your advantage. 